We're joined by experienced fullback Paul Cliff. Welcome to the club. How do you feel about signing for AFC Newsley? Yeah, but I um, feel good, you know. Um, it's a good start. Having a year out last year, um, obviously watching my daughters at Man City. So I just got the book to come back and, you know, I just wanted to play. So I spoke to Brani, thought, you know what, a lot better club to come to at the minute with obviously the, the facilities, everything around them, the people that obviously are behind the scenes. It's just a great club to come play for. Obviously, rocked and rolled into pre season. How's it been so far? Yeah, yeah, we um, sort of got myself back a little bit easier than what I thought I'd expected because I've not really done anything. But I've been chipping away at the bits, getting in, getting my pre season doing, and obviously, like Wednesday's performance, the performance before that, it just shows that we've got a great group of lads and we're just going to get our heads down and obviously, hopefully, push for that title for next year. Obviously, like you say, an experienced experienced player like yourself, what can you bring to this team for the, to help the younger lads yeah. progress just, themselves? Just a lot of experience of a bit of relaxed and calmness where I see young lads have wanted to impress the manager and I've seen it before and you've just got to just take what the manager says, give the advice out and just obviously push them to where they need to be and maybe that push can get them to a one league above or a next league or, and I've done my job then. What are your expectations as a team for the league this season? As a team? And I'll tell you here, with the players we've got behind us, with the staff, with everyone around us, we should be pushing for that title. Um, with everyone who's experienced and who's got background of football, we should definitely be at that top and pushing to get up to that counties next year with the squad we have. Obviously, we've had a few pre-season games now. Um, today we straight through and got a 3 free draw against Cheshire Lions. Your thoughts? Just, you know... Every game's different, you know, the the different game on Wednesday where they was they were a very good the at least four leagues but above us. But you know, today it was a different kettle. We sort of dropped our standards and every player when he dropped the standards it's just not good enough and obviously they've been in there being in the changes, the gaffers turned around and said, Listen, that's not good enough and they all know to push on because, as I said, Tuesday is going to be a different game, a different test, and we need to make sure that we're prepped and we're ready and we need to actually get down to business and show people that we're not messing around this year. Are you glad you've joined Nosley and how excited are you about the project? Um, obviously I'm very glad. Um, I left, but it wasn't my plan to leave my other club in the summer, but things happened and then it's only been two weeks, but for me from now it's, it's perfect so far, yeah. How do you feel as pre-season's gone? Uh, like I say, it's only been two weeks, uh, so it's early doors, but you know, we've come in. So obviously standards very high, you know, p professional standards from the start, everything we do. Um good lads, sort of older lads and then a few like yourself, a few younger lads have come in and it's it's a good mix, you know, we're setting good standards for ourselves. Um today maybe first half we dropped off a little bit, but apart from that, I think you know the training, the get previous games, the standards have been dead high and that's what I like. I like, you know, the competition and competing for everything. What's the expectations from you for the season? Um, well, for myself, I want to just keep playing, playing as much as I can. Um, and know if it comes a time and I have to sit on the bench for a bit and support the lads, I will do. But I want to play first and foremost. That's what I've come to do. I'm still young, still want to play games. And then for the team, it's, it's win the league, not unless. Uh, I've got to say, I won the league last season from the other team. I've got to say, for it, I've got to bug for it. And, you know, it becomes a habit and I, and I want to keep that habit going. And do you think that sort of mentality, do you think that will bleed into the dressing room from guys like yourself who have won in the past? And yeah, I think, like uh, well, I've come, I've come in with a couple of the lads who, who last season and, you know, everyone else who's here have all won things, you know, like the older lads, they've all been about and won things. And we've all lost things as well, we've all lost finals and, and what happened, we know what losing feels like, we know what winning feels like and, you know, we only want one of them at the end of the yeah. day. So, how do you feel about joining the club and being made captain? Yeah, thank you for that. I'm um, very excited to be fair. It's going to be an exciting season, I think. Um, Brownie's put some fantastic things in place. Um, so, we're really looking forward to it. This season has been very good. Um, good turnouts for the sessions, the games uh, have been a positive start. So, yeah, we're really looking forward to it. And what are your expectations for yourself over the course of the season? Um, for me personally, I think this season is about getting as many minutes on the pitch as I can. I think the past couple of seasons have been hit and miss, so personally, um, getting as many minutes as I can and, and performing to the best I can on the pitch. Uh, and then for the team, I think we need to push uh, and be as high up that league as we can. And how high up are you, are you looking for? 
Uh, well, we, we want to win the league. Uh, that's that's our ambition. Um, we've got the players. Uh, we've got the backing from the from the club. We've got the the facilities. We've got everything in place um, behind the scenes and on the pitch to to go and push uh, and potentially win the league. Is that's what we want. So yeah, you, you you believe that the club itself and all the facilities and the squad itself are all ready to go and, and win. 100%. Yeah, yeah, we back each other on the pitch. Uh, and I know you, you guys, uh, the management team, everything back each other off the pitch and we, we believe in everything that this club's doing. So yeah, we, we believe we can go win the league and, and take this club even further.